nothing much And now holds but half Nelson And the loving touch The comfort and the joy The only living boy in Ukraine I'm absolutely delighted with the outcome of the general election. Uh, may I say firstly that I feel deeply honoured to have been given the opportunity of continuing the work I've started in the last 16 months. It's been an exhilarating 16 months and it is the most enormous privilege to have the opportunity of serving as Prime Minister. Party politics clear by four. He's keeping up the gallop. Carl Wollowellen's going for everything, but it's going to be party politics national. They've got a hundred yards to go, and it's party politics in the lead, striding resolutely up towards the line. And party politics is going to wake it. Party politics and election. Why the lips are hearts and flowers from the glass and crowd? Say five or six on baths and shouts. Come on home, come on home to the comfort and joy.
Bates who could go for it, Slater, Bishop's with him, this is Bishop, 4-0, and that's Ian Bishop's first Upton Park goal of the season, and he waves to the North Bank. He really does. He's shouting. He's always I mean, shouting at him, and he balls at me here, and he balls at me there. You can hear his balls all over the place. And I do my best. I swear I do my best. I mean, I bend over backwards. I mean, well, that's another story, but never mind. <laughs> defeating seven days virtually seals their fate. Defender Tim Breaker adding to their problems with this dreadful back pass. Mark Bright saying thanks very much. Palace scored a second when Chris Coleman accepted an Easter gift from goalkeeper Miklosko. West Ham are definitely down if Coventry get that extra point.
take it. Well, obviously, it looks like we have left it a little bit late, but I think we owed our fans one decent performance this season, and I think that it gave them a lot to cheer about tonight, so we're all exceptionally pleased about that. I mean, we've been putting quite a lot of commitment in. I think I've played the last five games, uh, and it's the first, first five games for 16 months, and, and we've given some good performances here. Uh, I mean, Monday we played quite well against Crystal Palace, put a lot of effort in, uh, and we give two silly goals away, so things have been going against us. Tonight, no mistakes, uh, and obviously I think we got the break with the goal. And it was it was it was a committed game, and, and the fans really got behind us. And every, all of these things, all these elements, sort of got behind or got into everybody. And I think it just happens. You know, you, you can never really figure out why it happens, but you could see there was a, a desire there tonight and a belief in ourselves, and it and it all comes come good in the end. I suppose that's what we've been really looking for all season. We've we've only produced it maybe early on. I think the month of November where we uh, we beat Tottenham, Arsenal, and drew with Liverpool on the telly. I think it's been a while since we've played like that. We. We played quite well against Norwich when we beat them 4-0, you know, we, we clicked on that day, but it, it still wasn't as good a performance as we showed today. Nobody came out and said that like, the, the pressure's off because you're all down. Um, I, I just think the lads, you know, they seem to rise to the occasion tonight. They've showed tonight what, what good supporters they are. They've turned out here and packed the place out. And, they, you know, they wasn't, they, they wasn't quiet all night. You, you, you've heard them after the game, I mean, they're singing, we are bottom of the league, but, you know, they're as, they're as happy as anybody tonight. It's disappointing, I mean, it was a great night tonight. Um, Please, we give the crowd something to sort of have a cheer about. You know, they've had a, a long, hard season here, and uh, it's been a depressing one for them. And at least, you know, they went home happy with that. It was a good game of football, I thought. And I suppose uh, the fact that Man United, the top of the league, going to the title, this gives us something to, to grab hold of, and just uh, and it lifted us tonight. Um, you know, I uh, just wish this could have happened a couple of months ago.
from the chairman through the board and to all the staff and the ladies even who do the washing you know it, it's it's such a happy place and it, it's been a pleasure really for me because it, you know i haven't really been under any stress at all Where you've risen 